All right. We uh, we uh, dumped out our maggot buckets today, and uh, I'll be showing. I'll dump one in the morning and show you how they, what I do, and how they handle it. But they just get up on top of it and start scratching, finding little bugs, finding little bits of myrtle and girt. <laughs> uh, they uh, enjoy munching on it really well, and uh, tomorrow I'll dump over one of those. We're uh, going to be getting some uh, heads, some guts next weekend, and uh, hopefully it'll be warm enough for us to set up a, uh, a maggot bucket for, uh, for starting the year off. If not, we'll throw them in the freezer for a couple of weeks until uh, we do get some nice warm weather. And uh, this will end up getting posted um, probably before, probably before, but the dumping it out tomorrow, um, and then uh, it'll be set up in a in a longer series. But we're soaking wet, man. So dumping them out there, they were green on top, and uh, this is giving it a good, nice little scratching area for them to to kick all the stuff around and make it a little less nasty inside so uh it uh the that bucket had all kinds of stuff in it through the course of the year it had uh rabbits it had chickens that had died or either we killed or had died um had rabbits that we had killed or that we had killed or died also so uh it produced quite a few maggots through the year and uh now they're just enjoying scratching around, having a little ball, finding whatever they can find in there to eat. So, uh, just all kinds of, yeah, I don't see nothing. You had the hawk go over there earlier and you didn't say nothing, you dummy. So, my, my new roosters are not exactly the brightest thing in the world. So, anyway, um, the old guy's still around, but <laughs> he, he's getting pretty old at this stage. So, all right, I'm gonna cut this off and uh, I'll probably add some to this in the morning. I'll show it being dumped, up, the other one being dumped over, uh, getting prepared for uh, for next weekend when we should be uh, picking up uh, quite a bit more um, pig. So, uh, all right, I'll let you go for now, bye. All right, I'm going to, uh, yesterday we uh, dumped out the uh, one maggot bucket. I've got two more to go. I'm only going to dump out this one today. Uh, it's uh, freezing here this morning, so we got a light frost. So uh, there's no maggots going around. <laughs> and these have been pretty well exhausted for a couple of days now. Well, actually for several months now. Um, we don't put out maggot buckets in the uh, winter. Um, the the uh, material will rot and... My understanding is that's where you're likely, most likely to get your disease. Threw them out a little bit of lettuce this morning. A couple of them are pecking around. And uh, as you can see, we've got one over there drinking out of a skating rink. <laughs> They've picked it down. Anyway, all I'm going to do is just dump this out like I did yesterday. And uh, it won't take any time at all for half of them will be over here wanting to uh, eat it. There we go. This is a little harder with one hand than you would think. <laughs> there we go. There we go. There we go, guys. I have to call them over. There they come. There comes a few. I throw them a little scratch so I can get them out of my way. And, uh, Certain areas I like them to clean up. And after the little bugs, little doodle bugs, and whatever else is in there. So, yesterday they scratched it all down and knocked it all out. So, and like everybody else in the country, we're wet, 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 wet right now. Well, I don't know about everybody in the country, but talking on some Facebook groups, um, there are a lot of people flooded in. I live in an area where if we flood, if I actually, if it actually flooded on my property, about three quarters of the state of Georgia would be underwater. 
By the way, there's our pig head. One of our pig heads from last year. We never took it out. Got a nice little jaw. That'll probably freak my wife out. But the dogs will enjoy it for a couple of days. Once I let them in here with the chickens. So, uh, anyway. It served, uh, it served its purpose and worked very well for us. We got a lot of maggots and now the chickens are getting to scratch it again scratch through it again um and during the year course of the year we just threw scrape back and threw you know carcasses or whatever we, we whenever we would kill chickens and to eat or kill rabbits to eat or whatever else like that we just scratch the stuff back and uh put more carcasses in there and we get another blast of uh maggots so it's a very handy, very handy, very easy, simple way to do it. Um, I've seen people doing things on, on, you know, other sites that, that are a lot more complicated than ours. Um, and like I said, the, the cost is, we buy the wood shavings, <laughs> the, the buckets I get for free. So, uh, and as you can see, the chickens will be quite entertained for several hours today. We may or may not dump out the third one, but uh, even my dog grabbed a little bit of stuff for yesterday. From uh, one of my dogs grabbed a little bit of stuff. She's dragging it around now. It's a felt uh, look like it's fur or something, probably a rabbit. So, uh, all right, this is just kind of how we clean it up and get it ready for uh, this year. Like I said, we got a. We'll probably come. We'll probably set up a. Depending on how cold it is and how cold they're predicting, I'm going to tip this over on the side so they can get in there and play. Uh, depending on how cold it is, we may not set one up this weekend simply because if the meat starts to rot and then the maggots get in there, there tends to be more of a chance of getting diseases. Whereas if it's you know already a little bit warm and you got flies out, that's the time to really you want to do it. So they... the the stuff we may end up getting this weekend, we may throw in the freezer and just wait um, for a couple of weeks on. So, all right, I'm going to go ahead and turn this off. And uh, if you enjoy this, I'd ask you to subscribe. Um, depending on our weather, we may have a video on, uh, we may well have a video on uh, maggot buckets again this weekend. So, all right, if you like it, I'd ask you to subscribe. Bye.